On this episode of Great Americans, we look back on the accomplishments of an extraordinary young man, Quill Clemento. At the 2012 Olympics, he won a record nine medals. Here's a clip from the highlight reel. And fabulous. Quill has absolutely zero known body fat. This is attributable to his rigorous exercise regimen and personal trainer, Rex Rico. We sat down with Quill for an exclusive interview. What is the catalyst for your amazing success? Well, I'm just really focused. Not being in a relationship really helps free up my time. I have little distractions in my life, and that's how I like it. And there you have it, Quill Clemento, the most interesting man in the water. Back to you. Here's some protein for you. Thanks, Rex. Impressive, sir. How are those eggs? Mmm, that hit the spot. I better get going, though. I'm late for my real estate appointment. I'm looking for a house, something with an indoor swimming pool. You look familiar. Didn't I see you on the cover of the paper? Which one? I was in the paper, too. I was the sunshine girl. Can I have your autograph? I don't have pen or paper with me. I have a pen and paper upstairs. Oh. Mmm. Ah. That was a really stimulating conversation. Mm-hmm. You really touched me emotionally. You're one of the most interesting people I've ever met. I'd really like to see more of you. I would love to see more of you too. Do you want to go for dinner? Yeah, I would. Ahoy, hoy. Oh, you finally picked up the phone. I've been so worried. It's not like you to miss swim practice. Where have you been? The water's getting cold. Getting cold? But I'm not even in there yet. Anyways, I'm on a date with... I'm sorry, what was your name, my love? Cinnamon. Sinclair. I think you're spending too much time with this woman. It's going to start impacting your swimming performance. This towel, it's going to waste. I'm sorry, I gotta go. Now where were we? Oh yeah, you're so beautiful. I know. Quill, we've been together for two weeks now, and you haven't really shown any sign of commitment. I want to get married, I want to have a family. I can't do that if every time there's an Olympics you're training for them. So what's it going to be? Your backstroke or me? You're my soulmate. I love you. Do you? Or am I just something on the side? Something to keep you busy in between laps at the pool? Swimming is my passion. I've been doing it since I was five. I'm not the type of girl that will give someone an ultimatum. But you have to choose. Me or the swimming. Can't I do both? I lost my brother to swimming. I'm not going to lose you too. I, I never knew you felt this strongly. I'll turn in my swim cap. It's a small price to pay for a chance at love. No, you can't quit. What about the kids who look up to you? What about the endorsements? And what about me? What am I going to do? I'm sorry. I'm getting older. I've shattered every swimming record. There's nothing left for me to accomplish. Now, I'm navigating the uncharted waters of love. What about all the good times we shared? Sorry, it's over. Finally, I'm free. Good, honey, um, can you take the garbage out? And here's a list of things I need at the drugstore. Great, I'll go right now. I have something I want to give you. I melted down my nine Olympic gold medals to make this ring. Cinnamon, will you marry me? Oh, Quill, yes, yes, of course I will.